uh, last week, good accountants called my wife and I and said, we have a great client for you. So we said, okay, where is it? Danbury, Connecticut. So we met him and he hired us on the spot. We already started working already and the annual billing is going to be $38,000 a year, which is now our biggest client. And Mr. B, we'll call him. Mr. B owns the auto rental company, an auto repair service company, a U-Haul trailer sales and rental company, and real estate. And he wants us to do the QuickBooks inputting and the sales tax returns for Connecticut and his corporate and partnership tax returns for himself. And the billings will be for the next three years in excess of $100,000 if you add all three years together. Right. So what happens is I, I'm going to do like all the QuickBooks uh, aspect of it. And then Raymond will supervise me. I mean, it's just kind of look over the numbers right. and all that. Uh, do sales tax if for some reason I, I can't go in and do them. And then you'll handle all the um, tax returns. Yeah, tax returns, partnership, LLC, and, and whatnot. Correct. And actually when they called us up, they actually wanted us to go to, together because... Um, Al Chisholm from Good Accountants said that um, he called us the dynamic duo um, and he actually wanted us to go together uh, because um, we, really I, are, we really are a good team. Yeah, I mean he, he, he has some services that he can offer, I have other services that I can offer and then Correct. we just combine them together, it, it really is a, a perfect fit. And the client was actually very happy, um, like she said he is happy, not was, but he is happy. So yeah, no, he's, he's a nice client. Uh, I think that's probably one of the best ones that he's gotten us, yes. right? I would think, yeah. Ray and Carmela Passero were first contacted by Al Chisholm, a senior business consultant with goodaccountants.com in 2011, concerning an event planning company doing $4 million in annual sales. The company was looking to retain the services of a certified public accountant to provide tax planning and year-end tax filings, along with an outsourced bookkeeper that could take over the bookkeeping for their internal bookkeeper of 20 years, who was retiring. The engagement was perfect for the Passeros, since Ray is a certified public accountant who specializes in tax and audit services, while Carmela runs her own outsourced bookkeeping business. The referral was the first of more than 80 subsequent referrals that would be made to the Passeros by GoodAccountants.com over the next four-year period. The Passeros' most recent client acquisition from GoodAccountants.com is a $36,000 yearly billing business client with operations based in Danbury, Connecticut. In February of 2011, I received a phone call from Mr. Al Chisholm, who works for GoodAccountants.com, and he got me interested. So I said, I'll investigate and meet you. So I went to Long Island and met Al Chisholm and Johanna. Yeah, but I was skeptical at first. I, I, I don't know. I, you know, you just get this phone call and you, I, I don't know. I just had never heard of them and I, I was just very skeptical, but he's, he's more of the optimistic person, so. It worked out very well for us so far. It did. I mean, it really did. And, and of course, he says, see, I told you so. <laughs> I, I really think it's the quality of the clients that they, um, <clears throat> excuse me, that they presented to us. They weren't like these fly-by-night clients. They were established businesses. Right. Um, I, I mean, it just worked out. And they just kept calling us. We have another client. We have another client. I said, oh, my gosh, really? Wow. Yeah, I mean, they, they, you know, we just got phone calls the other day. I think we just got like two phone calls. We just got two clients the past back. week. Yeah. From goodaccountants.com. One, yeah. one, one is our largest client now. Yeah. He pays us around 38, 39,000, 40,000 a year. So if we keep him for four or five years, we'll have almost $200,000 of billings from one client from goodaccountants.com. That'll pay for our daughter's college tuition. <laughs> Since February 2011, when we first started with goodaccountants.com, they referred us 14 clients and we landed 13. Only one we didn't get, and that was the first one. Was a rest with which was a restaurant slash deli catering, yeah. so we landed thirteen or fourteen clients, which is amazing. Which is why I love good accountants. Yeah, and actually they're working on another client for us. Um, <clears throat> actually, we're we're in contact, and if I land that client, not not including doing tax work that you'd be doing for them, but just for the uh, my end of it, the bookkeeping accounting end of it, it'd be in excess of ten thousand dollars for the year, you know, which is nice, you know. And then I got about three to four clients from them. And those billings are in excess of twenty thousand so. dollars. And my annual billings are around forty nine thousand dollars per year. So 
49 and 20, that's 69. And if we get this other client 10, you know, you're talking about $80,000, you know, and, and, and they just, they just keep calling us with, with clients. So I know they're not going to stop calling us because, uh, um, you know, clients love us. I mean, they really do, you know. And, uh, and I just want to say a couple of things. The clients they're sending us are not fly-by-nights or yeah. startups. No. I have two amazing clients that I got from goodaccountants.com. One is a, does electronic recycling for the state of Connecticut. Oh, yeah. Right, right. You bring your electronics to the, his office and he re recycles it, puts it in machines, takes all the plastics out, takes all the silver out, all the metal out, and recycles it for the state of Connecticut. The second client, which I got about two years ago, is an amazing client. She restores historic sites to the original yeah. look. The carpeting, the, the curtains, the, the, the paint. I believe, she is, isn't she working on the Vanderbilt mansions? Yes, she is. In, um, in, in Newport, Rhode Island. Correct. All those mansions that, uh, yeah. And I, you couldn't ask for nicer clients. You really couldn't ask for nicer clients, really. And I'm very, I'm satis <laughs> very satisfied with the quality of clients. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, absolutely. Sometimes the lead doesn't work out. Um, no fault of good accountants. Um, it's just that maybe the client, you know, decides to go another direction or uh, whatever the reason is. But I, I think really more nine times out of ten, I think that's it's you know really been more po it's been positive. Yes, it has. I've used loads of different means of marketing and advertising, and nothing else works. Yeah. But good accountants has been really good for me. Yeah, no, the advertiser just doesn't work. I mean, I've tried, um, and I know you have too. Local penny saver. Um, it just, it just, I don't know, it just doesn't work. You know, we did TV commercials, a TV ad, right? And maybe you got one person, I think, and that was it. Right. All that time and money that we spent, and it just was uh, futile. So. Until what happened? Until we stopped using penny saver ads, TV commercials, yeah. and radio ads. We totally stopped. Yeah, and they I spent over $10,000 on TV commercials, penny saver ads, marketing, mailings, no, none of that stuff works. In our business, it's all referrals. Yeah. And the last thing I want to say is I would absolutely refer goodaccountants.com to any other accountant yeah. as long as they're not in my territory. <laughs> Hands off.